In this video I will show how to compute the probability of a normal random variable being in a given interval. When working with a normal random variable, the most important fact to remember is that all the answers to the questions like this can be obtained by relating this normal random variable to the standard normal random variable z. In our case we have the probability of x being greater than 12.9 and we're going to do this process in two steps. Uh, first we're going to subtract the mu and divide by sigma both sides of the inequality inside of the parentheses. Remember to write letters to letters, numbers to numbers, that is we're going to write mu and sigma near x but we're actually going to subtract mu and divide by sigma number 12.9 and in the second step, we're going to rewrite x minus mu over sigma with z, and we're going to compute the expression on the right side of the inequality, which is equal to negative 1.22. Uh, once we converted the original problem to the question about z, we can finish the problem the same way we learn it um, when working with the standard normal variable. So in our case, because we have a greater inequality instead of less than, we're going to first use the probability rule and rewrite the expression like this. And then we are going to look in the table for the row negative 1.2 and the column 0 0.02 to find the probability of z being less than this number, which is 0 0.1112, and at the very end we just have to subtract this number from 1. So the final answer is 0 0.8888.